Today we're going to be mounting a hose reel onto a masonry wall and I'm going to be using a corded hammer drill to get the job done. With a hammer drill it's got a, a bit of a percussive nature to it so as it drills it sort of hammers at the same time and it'll get through these hard substrates. Okay, so this drill itself's also got a little filter system on it so that when you're drilling, quite often you get a lot of mess and dust that drops down, but the little filter here is going to try and capture some of that and keep the side a bit cleaner. Also, we've got a depth gauge here as well. So the idea being is that I've set that little gauge there so that the drill will just drill a little bit deeper than that, which is always a good thing to do, and I know that I'll get the depth of the hole right every single time. Okay, so before I start, I just want to show you now, this drill here, whilst it is a hammer drill, it'll also function as a normal drill. So what you just want to make sure is that it is switched to the hammer setting, and then also it's got a speed setting here. We've got uh, one and two, so it's always good to start on a slower speed. So I'm just going to switch that back to one, now a little template here that came with the actual kit, I've just uh, taped it onto the wall so that I know exactly where it's going to sit and I don't have to worry about getting the holes wrong. Alright, so that's our holes done. Now as you can see we've got a little bit of dust here, but our little chamber in here is full of dust as well, so it's captured most of it and kept the site pretty clean. So it's done the trick beautifully. Well, that's it for drilling into masonry. As you can see, it's not too hard to do. You've got the right tools, a bit of know-how, you go a long way. <laughs>